Ohio, where we're at for this college football matchup. This coin toss presented by Nissan. Innovation that excites. See how these two teams play in this game as they prepare for the opening kickoff. He's out to the 30. Tackle made at the 34-yard line. The Buckeyes having a wide receiver like this, I think sometimes it even helps a young quarterback because this kid goes out there, he works hard in practice every day, and I think he really lifts the whole offense. I think he does. I think he's almost like having an extension from the coaching staff into the locker room with the players. He's a guy that makes big plays, but I think he takes it upon himself to be able to help out with some of the other receivers, make sure that they're all on the same page, understand the route adjustments, understand everything that goes on with being a wide receiver and the importance of blocking. So all the little things that seem to add up and make big plays, uh, I think this guy un totally understands his responsibilities being a go-to player. And now he's got room to run. Runs outside for a nice game. That was a good play by the halfback. Picked up about five yards on the option. From their own 39-yard line. Third down. They might be coming here. Makes the catch, and the defense is all over him. They bring him down for a loss. Three and out. Yeah, the defense did a great job of winning that series. That brings us fourth and seven. Gets it away, and this is a really nice punt. He's tackled at the 28-yard line. The quarterback brings his troops out onto the field for the first drive of the game. And down he goes, right around the 38-yard line. From their own 38-yard line, it's second down. Nice run there. So he got a few yards on that carry. If you can continue to pick up small chunks of yards like that, you can really start to wear a defense down. his way to about the 48. That's a team that makes it second and two. Second and two yards to go. Ball on the 48-yard line. Nice run up the middle. That's good enough to pick up the first down. This young man ran with some purpose there and picked up six yards. Now, they talked about doing this, but I didn't think we'd see the hurry up this early. Brought down at about the 29-yard line. Just another weapon for this offense. He's got good hands, and he's tough to bring down. He showed right there that he can make something big happen. From the 29-yard line, first down. Make the stop at the 20-yard line. That's a three, two, three. That brings up second and one. All day, just like that, just like that. Mike 35, Mike 35. Yeah, check hey, three. Hey, look back, look back. Check three, check three. And he's hit before he can go anywhere. First down. 
And this play is number eight on the drive. And he's tackled just outside the goal line. First and goal from the one, looking to punch this one in. And the goal line defense digging in here. He's taken down around the one yard line. Tenth play of the drive. Touchdown, Scarlet Knights. Back just plowed his way into the end zone. Yeah, but it wasn't all him. The offensive lineman just pancaked the defense on that one. And he adds the extra point. A nice 10 play, 72 yard drive. And they add seven points to the scoreboard. And Brad, right now, the offensive line just winning the battle in the trenches, opening up some big running. So the score now. 7-0. Johnson from the four. Across the 30. They'll bring him down at the 35-yard line. The Scarlet Knights are right where they want to be early in this one, partner. Well, this is what their coach talked about, getting off to a great start. The defense did their job, and it's nice to see the offense move the ball down the field and also get some points on the board. You never like to have to play from behind, but a deficit this manageable shouldn't be in the front of their minds. They just need to go out there and play. Nice run to the outside. That'll make it second and seven. It's second down, seven to go. Ball on the 39 yard line. Tackle made at the 38 yard line. The defense was able to get really good penetration and drop him short of the line of scrimmage. for a quarterback to know that he's got a receiver like this who can step up when he needs him on third down. First and 10, ball on the 44. Check three, check three, check three. And he's tackled after positive yardage. We're through one quarter. The Scarlet Knights with a touchdown lead. And we're ready for more football here in quarter number two. Six-yard line. Gain of one on the play. That'll bring up third and two. It's third down, and they're about two yards shy of the sticks. Good job by the defense to overpower the offensive line and drop the back for a loss. He doesn't want to touch back here. He wants to knock this ball inside the 10. He really got a hold of that one. 
Little too much leg into that punt. They'll bring it out to the 20. With one quarter down, I really haven't seen too much separation between these two squads. Might be neck and neck the whole way. Rutgers is up seven. Tackle after a decent run up the gut. We've got a second and five. Ball on the 25-yard line. Takes it up the middle for a nice run. Play action and rolling right. Now he's scrambling. Quick throw, incomplete, one of his receivers. This quarterback has got to do a better job of looking off defenders and allow his coverage receivers some room to improvise and get free. Second down and 10 to go. Ball on their own 32. Throws complete and he stopped immediately. That'll bring up third and four. Listen to this place. Completes it, and he's hit hard immediately. A one-yard gain on the play. You know, this veteran wide receiver is not always easy to stop. So that's a good job here by the defense to slow him down. So it's fourth down, and the offense is still on the field. This is a very questionable play call here. I'm not sure I agree with it. He's tackled around the 44-yard line. Rutgers is up a score. Yeah. And he carries the ball for a nice game. That'll make it second and four. This is the eighth play of this drive. He scrambled. He's under pressure. They'll bring him down at the 43. Game seven yards. First down. From the 43 yard line, it's first down. scrambling he's got the corner and he shoved out of bounds at the 32 yard line that's doubly bad for this defense giving up a big run like that and then letting him get out of bounds to stop the clock this is the 10th play of this drive and he's taken down around the 21 yard line From the 21 yard line, first down. Now he tries to buy some time. Fires to the line out, first down. And that sets them up with a first and goal. That makes it first and goal. This is the 12th play of the drive. Well, after that injury, we'll get to see the backup quarterback here. And off to the left. He makes it out to maybe the seven yard line. Second 
Rutgers up seven points. And he makes it out to about the five yard line. The Scarlet Knights will use their first time out of the half. It's third and goal from the five. Let's see if they can put this one in. The Scarlet Knights, he's quarterback, taken off earlier. Down on the sideline right now. Doesn't look like he's in that much pain, and I would bet that we'll see him back in the game before the day is over. He's in trouble, and down he goes at the one-yard line. Watch out for a pass play when you're in a goal line D. Space to run and just bursting in for six. He splits the uprights with the extra point. We played a half of football. The Scarlet Knights lead 14-0. Glad to have you with us in the studio for the EA Sports NCAA Football 14 Halftime Show presented by Nissan. Innovation that excites. Reese Davis and David Pollock here completely locked in on that first half. Ball security was a major theme coming into this game, and both offensive coordinators have to be thrilled with the fact that their offenses, first and foremost, did a good job of taking care of the ball. And you don't see it every game, that's for sure, that both teams don't have a turnover at the half. And you usually see those critical mistakes that set up a short field for you to take advantage of. And, and it's definitely nice. It's nice to be able to put in a plan all throughout the week and to be able to execute it and not to be able to make those big mistakes. Because coaches will tell you, it's those big mistakes that kill you. It's okay to be rushed in the pocket as a quarterback and then throw it to your mom in the third row. Don't throw it in harm's way. Both quarterbacks done a good job, and as a result, both teams with zero turnovers in the first half. Looking forward to seeing this second half. I think there's certainly a want for victory. A want and a need for victory. Some teams need this victory, Reese Davis. Want, need, got to go get it either way. Brandon Kirk are there to deliver. All right, Reese and David, welcome back, everybody. Just about set to start the second half. And he got all of this one. Great kick. He makes it out to maybe the 16-yard line. They're ready to begin another drive. Second down, 10 yards to go. Ball on the 16. Play fake. Here comes the defense, and he just gets rid of it. Brad, I just think this quarterback's got to do a much better job of being able to read that defense and make quicker decisions. And especially when the defense starts to get pressure, you've got to either get rid of that football or check it down or take off and run with it. It's arguably the loudest crowd in the nation, and they are turning it up a notch. And they bring him down for a sack on the play. Boy, this pass rush is sometimes scary. They're really getting after the quarterback now. And that's three and out. Nothing going on that series. Fourth and long here after the sack. The defense looks like they're going to send in the cavalry on this one. 
It's away. Short punt. There's got to be some sense of urgency to this offense right now. They don't have the luxury of wasting drives if they want to get back in the game. Runs outside for a nice game. So he holds on to it and gets a good five yards. That brings him second and five. Second and five coming up here. Ball on the 48. Knocked out of bounds at the 49. It to the 48 yard line. Let's see if he aims for the sideline and tries to get this thing down deep in their own territory. So this one goes into the end zone, and that'll be a touchback. Squads are digging in now. Let's see what happens on this next drive. Scrambling around. Throws complete. He's got room to work. Out of bounds at the 40-yard line. That makes it first and ten. From their own 40-yard line. First down. Brought down at the 43-yard line. They need to get it out to midfield. Gets it out to his receiver in a hurry. And they make the stop around the 38-yard line. And a nice pick up there. I'll tell you what, the defense gambled a bit here and came with the blitz. And a quarterback showed tremendous poise by making a good read and delivered a nice ball to the open man. First and ten. Ball on the 38-yard line. Mike 35. Mike 35. Here we go. 59 Philly. 59 Philly. Nice run, and he's brought down. It's second and six. Ball on the 34-yard line. Here we go. 59 Philly. 59 Philly. He's on the run. Inside the 10. Throws it in a hurry. What a play, and 
that is first and goal. down and they've got their eyes on that goal line. Nice run there. Six yards there on the counter. That brings him second in goal. Here's the eighth play of the series. the PAT. Everyone's all lined up and ready for the kickoff. He sends this one deep. He's to the 20. And he's taken down at the 22-yard line. Scarlet Knights continue to get it done on the defensive side of the football turf. Yeah, they've done a good job of building this lead and almost determined here to protect it. Let's see if they can hold on here for the rest of the way. That's three down and one to go. The Scarlet Knights with a three touchdown advantage. We're just about set to start action here again in the fourth quarter. Well, you know the offense would like to generate more than they did on their last possession. Looks left, finding his tailback. He's taken down right around the 18-yard line. That makes it second and 14. So it's second and 14. Ball on the 18-yard line. They come out in a five-wide set. Caught out in the open. Steps out of bounds. Right around the 22-yard line. Steps out right away. We've got a first and ten. Ball on their own 34. He gets rid of this one. to make a completion possible. You don't see it from every receiver, but this guy's got it.
from their own 49-yard line. It's first down. The quarterback in the gun with five receivers. And he's tackled around the 20-yard line. After the big pass play, we've got a first down. Tackle at the 11. They go with a run, and that'll be a gain of nine. That brings us second and nine. This play is number eight on the drive. They'll line up with five wide receivers. Zips it to his receiver. Touchdown. That's a positive for the passing game. It was absolutely the right call in that situation. converts the extra point. Well, this is strange. The kicking team is looking to kick the onside, but the return team's in their normal kick return formation. The hands team comes on the field for this onside kick. So the hands team does their job, and the onside is not successful. When people talk about special teams winning football games, they're usually talking about blocking kicks and big returns. But the onside return team can be just as important. And right now, these guys may have sealed the deal with that recovery. Tackle made at the 35-yard line. A nice job by the offensive line, and they pick up a gain of eight. That makes it second and two. So it's second down and about two yards to go. Four down, four down. Mike 35, Mike Less than three minutes in the game. Yard line. First down, ten yards to go. Ball on the seventeen yard line. Watch two, watch two. Get it again. They'll bring him down at about the 19-yard line. Loss of two on the run by the halfback. The Buckeyes will use their first time out of the half. Second and 12 coming up here. Ball on the 19. around the two-yard line. So the run goes for a big first down. The offensive line opens up some nice lanes to run through as well. Nice play. First and goal from the two. Let's see if they just don't try to power their way into the end zone here. Just under two to go in the game. And he 
tackles him hard at the five. He just timed the snap count there and really made a nice play. Ohio State will use their final timeout. kick this one off. He just drills this one. He's to the 20. He gets out to about the 22-yard line. Boy, the two offensive coordinators have to be loving this. In fact, you can look over at our booth next to us and see how much they're enjoying it with a big smile on their face. The defensive coordinators, on the other hand, might be looking for a pink slip on Monday. I'm sure there are a lot of fans out there hoping for a miracle, but I seriously doubt we're going to see one today. We have less than a minute to go. Under heavy pressure. Makes the first down catch. And they push him out at about the 31. It's second down now, and they're just a few feet away from that first down marker. Just might do it. Intercepted. And the quarterback just can't believe it. He really wishes he could have that one back. Every quarterback has passes that he wishes he could have back. However, hey, a pick is a pick, and no one is going to care how bad he wants that one back. From their own 45-yard line, first down. He's scrambling. Gets it out quickly. That's a great tackle at the 28. That's just a great call by the coordinator there going to the air on first down. First down, 10 to go. Ball on the 28. He might not be able to get the pass off. Tries to get around the corner. He goes out of bounds. Around the 16-yard line. so sure he made the best decision that time. That was a pretty tight area he was trying to throw that one into. Now he tries to buy some time. Enzo, touchdown. but all it does is add to the blowout. This one's over. 
And we'll take a break while the injured players attended to. He splits the uprights with the extra point. The kicker looks like he's ready to kick this one off. Nice kick, plenty of distance. He's to the 20. And down he goes at the 25. Well, late in the fourth quarter, this game has been over for a long time, and now we just want to get out of here like these two teams do. Brought down at the 35. So it's second down, and they're only about a foot away from picking up the first down. Mercifully, this one is over. Rutgers, 35, Ohio State, 7. Thanks for joining us for another game of NCAA Football 14. For Kirk and everyone here at EA Sports, Brad Nussler saying goodbye, and we'll see you next time.